we will explore lookup a powerful function that allows you to search for specific information within your data this will enable you to efficiently retrieve and analyze data across different sheets and workbooks enhancing your data management skills please subscribe for more videos of excel we look into lookup functions the first one is v lookup or vertical lookup so the function that searches for a certain value in a column to return a corresponding piece of information of another column in the same data set so i'll explain this with an example let's say that you are working in a firm that is currently restructuring and you are assigned with this task to arrange the different salaries of employees according to their departments now you are the data set that you are given only only has employee ids and the corresponding salaries now your task would be number 1 to find who all employees work in what all departments and number 2 extracting those salaries from that employee ids so in order to extract that from the employee id if you go one by one manually it would take you a lot of time but this can be cut short through lookup functions so let's see how that works first we look at the syntax of this so the syntax would be equality v lookup open parenthesis now v lookup functions have four different parameters the first one is lookup value second is table array third is column index number and the fourth is true and false we'll know what that is one by one so the first one is a lookup value so lookup value would be the thing that we already know so in our case it would be employee id second is table array so this would be selection of entire data set third would be column index number now what it is let's see so let's say that in the data set you have two columns number 1 is your employee id and number 2 is the salary okay so in order to extract the salary that would be in column 2 so you would put the column index number as 2 and true and false so true is if you want a approximate match and false is if you want an exact match of it so now let's look at v lookup functions in microsoft excel now we have a spreadsheet which contains employee ids years of experience and salary of the employee now we need to find the salary of employee and we know what all employee id is there so employee id would be the thing that we already know and to find is salary employee now let's say that i want to find uh, a salary of this cell 2161 so i'll type here 2161 and i want to know the corresponding piece of salary so that corresponding piece of salary is 90140 90 40 so now with lookup functions we want if we just put the employee id the corresponding piece of sal salary should automatically come right so we'll use we look up in that case so in the salary column i'll use the syntax equality we look up open parenthesis now the first is the lookup value so our lookup value would be employee id so i would type employee id here so i'll click on this cell comma second is a table array so our table array is the entire data set so i'll select the entire data set next is i'll use the column index number so since the salary employee is is in column number 3 so i'll put as 3 comma now i want now it says that you want an approximate match or an exact match so i would go with an exact match so i'll write false false close parenthesis and enter so it says na since i have not input any employee id so let's cross check it so let's say 21126 right so i'll type here 21 Two six and press enter. So now it gives me forty nine thousand nine hundred forty two. Let's cross check. So the employee ID two one two six has a salary of forty nine thousand nine hundred forty two. Absolutely correct. So this is the way in which we use lookup functions, and we can type any other thing. Let's check of uh, let's say three seven seven three and press enter. Ninety-nine thousand twenty-nine. Let's see, seven three seven seven three. Ninety-nine thousand zero twenty-nine. It's absolutely correct. So in this way, we can use it. We can use it for years of experience as well. So let's say I want to type experience. 
exp exp so i can use the same function we look up open parenthesis look up value is again i'll put the employee id to find the years of experience comma we'll select the entire data set as a table array comma so years of experience is in column number two so i'll put two comma i want an exact match so i'll write false or instead of false i can also put zero that is also exact match so i'll put zero and close parenthesis and press enter so now it says that 3773 with a salary of 99,029 has an experience of 5.4 let's cross check it 3773 99,029 has the salary has the experience of 5.4 years so this way we can use lookup functions and it is very efficient to use in longer data sets as well next we'll talk about h lookup so similar to v lookup h lookup is the same except instead of column it searches row here so rest remains the same the certain value in a row would re return a corresponding piece of information and uh, the syntax of it also remains the same but instead of v we have h over here and also uh, the column we used to search in v lookup here in this case in h lookup we look at horizontal rows so the column would be replaced by row so let's look at the example in microsoft excel and know more about it so this is a spreadsheet here we have a table but now instead of columns we have rows what does that mean so generally we used to have column headers over here but now in this case these are horizontal headers or row headers we can call so the table is horizontally now similar to v lookup we'll know the price of uh, different office supplies using h lookup so this is the cell in which we need to find we'll we'll type the values the known value the known name like stapler pins sheets pens erasers or binders so we'll get the price of it automatically so let's click on this price tab press equals to h lookup h look up parenthesis open now it says lookup value so our lookup value is this cell comma our table array is the entire tables range comma row index number now instead of column index number we have row index number so our first row would be this second would be this third this and fourth this so we we want the price of it which is in the fourth one so we'll write here four comma now we need a exact match so we'll type false or zero whatever suits you then parenthesis close and press enter so since we haven't typed anything it shows in a we'll write here pins press enter it shows me the price of pins right we'll look at one more example so let's say i put stapler press enter it gives me the price of it so similar to v lookup h lookup also works exactly the same but in this case we have horizontal tables you would not get much examples of this while working on data sets but uh, still as an example you need to know that h lookup also exists watch the full video on our channel link is given below subscribe to our channel for more such content